Hey there, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Chris Omi. And, um, yeah, we went into a sale just because it was there. Just the day after we bought all these horses at the end of the last video. And there was a grade one sitting there. And we had the money. And we put the bid in and took the horse. So, I'd like to introduce you to a four-year-old grade one winner called Olympian England. Now, I don't know how good this horse is, but it won the Breeders' Cup Juvenile. It did win the Breeders' Cup Juvenile. Um, it hasn't done much else. It didn't do well in the Preakness. So, there is that. But it might be okay. I haven't looked yet. Just spoiler alert, I haven't looked. Peaked at 110, it's currently 19. The bars look pretty good across everything. Probably running at about a one mile one level, so and the last time it did, that was probably early August in Saratoga uh of last year. So yeah, I don't really think that's a one mile two. It could be, but it's probably more one mile one. Um, but either way, it hasn't raced there this season. So maybe that would help it out. But this could go in the breeding barn. We're looking for a high potential. 90 plus would be amazing. 80 plus would be really good. 70 plus gives us a chance. Anything below 70, I really don't know. I really don't know. Depends whether it's full potential, if it's like the ability and potential match, or if it's unmet potential, which we're not likely to meet this year. And of course, it's other stuff. So whether it races or whether it goes in the breeding barn, a lot depends on that potential bar. Here we go. Ooh, I... Hmm. Well, I mean... Hmm. I really don't know. I was expecting either really terrible or really good, and it's like right on the cusp of being acceptable. With a chance to be pretty good next season. Like, we could gain 15% next season and have a five-year-old stallion in the breeding barn with an 80% potential. That's that's kind of what I'm looking there. But it may go up even higher. And as a six-year-old, seven-year-old, if it's like a long-term kind of horse, it could have really good potential. Like, but it's not there now. It's 65. So, I'm not sure. <laughs> wow, that's an interesting one. I mean, I'm glad I took the risk, and I'm interested to see what it can do. Um, yeah, it's had a couple of bad seasons. It certainly has had a couple of bad seasons. Mile one or mile two? There's a lot more mile ones. Breeders' Club Classic, I mean... Oh, if, if, if you really just want to, like, go for it. You really just want to go for it and test this. That's a mile two right there. I mean... Okay, nobody seems, like, super amazing above us. It's high ratings, that's for sure. We'd be lowest rated. I don't know if we'd be can't if we're carrying nine three I'd give us a bit more of a chance, although the Pius looks decent. Yeah, went to France and got second in the mile four version of the of the race we won. Okay. Ooh. Could be a really good the horse, that could be a really good horse. Okay. So the Breeders' Cup, Cup Classic is a possibility. 
all really depends what we've got here instead. It's a group one handicap, but it's not an actual group race graded race. So, and then there'd be a Champions Cup in Japan, which I think is just suicidal to go for. Um, yeah. I just really don't think that's going to work. For two grand. Well, actually, it's going to be 36 grand. Um, for 36 grand, we're going to put ourselves in it. We're going to put ourselves in it. Okay. Still hasn't gained. Probably won't gain. We know this is an allowance at five. And then we've got our sixes. The Breeders' Cup Grid 2. And then a grid three towards the end of the year. Oh. Okay, I mean, it's... It's definitely something to think about. But I don't know if I really want to risk that. I mean, even if we win, it's not going to increase our potential rating. I don't think we look like a good enough horse to really win that race. But if we don't get blown out, it gives me hope going forward. If we do get blown out... Then maybe not. I maybe play. I don't know if you like race at a higher one. Maybe it gives you more potential for next year. I don't know. I really don't know. Um, but again, I'm tempted. Again, I am tempted. Hmm. And the last time we took the risk, Black Cuckoo won. Except no, because, I mean, the last time we took the risk, Black Cuckoo was almost unbeaten. Olympic England definitely is not that. Black Cuckoo was a really decent horse with tons of pace. Olympian England isn't. Black Cuckoo was racing against horses carrying over a stone extra. We're going to be top weight. And even then, Black Cuckoo came in for a bit of luck. Maybe that luck and the weight were offset by being abroad, but even then... There's still factors which made me more confident with Cuckoo than I should be with England. I really want to run this, but I'm really, really thinking it's a bad idea. We're going to pull. We're going to pull. Okay. We're going to pull. I'd like a grade one, but I'd like a grade one that we can maybe do something with. Still that grade two sitting there. Grade two at a mile one. I mean, that might give me distance, if nothing else. And let's face it, it'll give me nothing else, will it? It'll give me absolutely nothing else. And there's a grade three there. Uh, yeah, it's like end of December we got the thing anyway. The uh, yearling auction. Okay. But while we're here, what was it? Was it the mile? Two? I think it was a mile two, wasn't it? I think it was this one, six million. That sounds right. Did Delia win this? No, Carol Kill Festival. 
Okay. Dia came third. Handed and short handed. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I think at best we might have been fifth to sixth. At best. Yeah, no. No, probably the right call. Probably the right call. Okay, so. Delami's running a chat in on the 10th. And there is that much. Okay, so what's this? This is the grade two. This is the mile two. I thought it was a mile one. Oh, no, the mile one was in Japan, wasn't it? The mile one's this Japanese race, which... I really don't think we should race either. Okay, this might give us a mile two. If it doesn't, we can always test it on mile one. Depending. Yeah, okay. I'm just going to go and run this. It's only a grade 2. We've won a grade 1, apparently. We should be in here. We'd be high weight. we got some laid-back horses. Let's just run. Let's just run. If we win this, despite £6 extra, in what might be a half-decent field, then we're possibly grade 1 caliber. Now, whether we're top feature race, foreign race, Grade one. I mean, I highly doubt. I highly doubt that from what I've seen. But maybe we can get there. And if we can get there, and if we can do something, and, you know, if the potential's there, then, of course, the breeding barn is in play. And we do need one good stud in that breeding barn. So, a little bit of a move up. Ready between four and three. We're on the heels of the leader. We're going to run the bend, and... We come onto the straight from one and a half. Here we are. We are coming into the picture. Half a furlong left. Chasing down Chestnut Alfie. Yeah, we're the best horse in this field. I mean, we didn't run it particularly well. We only just get up. I might just be a short head. Woo. Trip a spot on. So we're a mile two. We 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 figured that much out. We figured that much out. We didn't hurt our rating. Ugh, I mean, yeah. Okay. Um. My other question is: Do we really want to try this mile one in Japan? I think. That would be, again, a really bad idea, like the uh, Breeders' Cup would have been. But I want to think it through. I want to think it through. I do want to think this through. Okay, okay. Let's think sensibly about this again. Now, we just won a grade two. This is another grade one. The Breeders' Cup was out because... Why was the Breeders' Cup out? We'd be high weight, so we'd have no advantage. There were some really good horses in there. We were in really poor form. We didn't know the distance. And I really liked one other horse in there I didn't think we could ever beat. Okay. Yeah, I don't think this horse is great. But we're not in poor form. There's... 
not really a horse that I really, really like. Yeah, okay, there's not really a horse I love. We know our distance might not be a mile one, though. We know that mile two is spot on, so don't know if we can bridge to a mile one. Got a little bit of adaptability we might be able to. But it's foreign. And we're, again, we're top weight. Yeah, I just don't think it makes sense. Oh, I really, really want to test this horse. I really want to take it out and just see what we can do. But no, I just don't think that's fair. Honestly, I just don't believe that's fair. So, is there anything? There's one selling race at five. Again, we didn't gain, did we? We didn't gain. No, we didn't gain. Group races, absolutely nothing. Okay, so we're done for the year then, basically. We're done for the year. Olympian won a grade uh, two, mile two, so that gives us something. It's not a feature race, it's not a grade one, it's not a test, but it gives us distance. So we're happy enough with that, and it didn't hurt anything. We run really well. Five out of seven there for Cuckoo, unlucky the other two. Big race got the luck when we really needed it to come through. Happy enough with that. And the 26th is our day. twenty six of the day for the yearlings. Not sure how much more we're going to get. Honestly. Probably should have gone through to the 10th. Because Delami raced on the 10th, and I was going to put all 4 million. I was going to put all 4 million on Delami. Won it easily. I mean, that would have taken us to 16. Uh, 16. That would have taken us to 6 million from 4. Not that it really matters, but it's a little bit disappointing. And yeah, I don't think we were over racing at all. Okay. I mean, in real life, we'd probably be accused of over racing there. Let's not mix uh, mix that up. Okay, he's got an rock star. You, sir. And not my horse. Blue reason, you are not my horse, madam. The rest of them may be. 3-1 and skip. Three one and skip. It's currently my plan for a lot of this. Let's get up to a point. Sadly, until that's faded, we can't actually like hit to the next auction, so it's a bit more annoying. Paying a bit extra. Paying a little bit extra. It's fine. We'll get this money straight back. It's another arm bark, no bite. believe we kept the other one. I believe we kept the other one. Okay, the final one. Not laid back. Let's get out of here. Rivers, madame. Doesn't look amazing. Hack gray. Wow. 
Ruželfort. Ne, no. Musical Francis, okay, okay. Low confidence, low enthusiasm. That's a little bit dangerous for me, but it hits a lot of things quite well. 300 grand again. Okay. Keep moi. We got keep, we got keep me, and we got keep moi. Um, we have to find names for those horses. Oh, imagine that with potential. Imagine that now sitting at like 60 ability and 70 potential as a one year old with all stats. Oh. It's almost worth keeping just to see if it can, if I can breed potential to it. You know? That's not a bad idea. That's not a bad idea. Experimental. Oh, I so wanted Valanges to be decent. So wanted it to be decent. Okay, so we're going to run through them. The end of the season. We are still quite low, low down. 50% win rate. We won 461,000 across the season. And, uh, yeah, I mean, some decent horses there that we're not really uh, competing with because we didn't have any horses to compete with them. Now, the two Samazat limes with Shopberry. Ooh. Plaything Springs. A little bit better. But yeah, that's not the best. That's not the best. Lolita's Valentine and Seeking the Best. Ooh. <laughs> that's. All back no by Tortiz with Lothian Reigns. Survives. Survives. That becomes keep this. Okay, Selkirk and Symphony. So much to like, so much to dislike. Lowish confidence, lowish enthusiasm, low consistency for what I'm looking for. But full finish. Plus 50 uh, cruising burst. And 75 extra speed. And it matures really quickly. Um, keep, why not? So much good and so much bad in there. Okay, Chris Johnson, we like that horse. Clowns, we were unsure but optimistic. Low consistency. Low consistency. Ooh, I mean, keep cool. that question mark. That's not a useful question. I mean, oh, and I don't know how to spell it. It just, it just wasn't working. And I, I mean, ugh. It's going to take some time to get up that. Yeah, it's going to take some time to get up there. I'm not really that fast. Um, ba, 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 ba. I 
don't have that much money, do I? <laughs> I don't have that much money. That is, that is, I told you it might happen. Oh, what were we last time? We were 65, so we gained up to about, nope. Oh, yeah, no, it didn't increase. Damn, 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 damn. Kill the horse who it can't breed. Send it out into the auction because we do not believe. I looked at that, I'm like, oh, that's really good. And I saw 72, and I'm like, oh, it's not what cuck Cuckoo's got. And the has got what Cuckoo's got. Okay, so we gained a little bit. We gained about 5% probably potential, but we can fill that. As a three-year-old, we can fill that. And that means potential of a four-year-old might go up to 90-ish. Um, but yeah, definitely a good racer. Already won a grade one. Um, young age, probably not going to gain distance, nowhere near a triple crown horse, but it is what it is. It is what it is. I'm just going to geld. I'm just going to geld the unraced two-year-olds. I mean, where's the keeps? That's my issue. They're like all over the place, aren't they? Okay. I'll tell you what, I'll be back when I've listed them all. Okay, full disclosure, we had a crash. Um... But it was to do with the computer, not to do with status orders. So, totally on our side, and can't fault the game for it. What did happen is we went back to the beginning of December, and yeah, things weren't identical. So, we basically bought as many of the same horses as we could. I've got keep more, I've got keep it. I don't know if this is a new horse or not, but it looks really decent in some places. Um, I've still got an experiment there with low confidence, but I think it's a better experiment than we had before. Uh, and I sold Olympian England this season rather than waiting for next season, get some more money back in. Slight profit. Slight profit. Ran it once, won a race. Uh, it was one seven two five thousand. One seven six five thousand and fifty. So, yeah, forty thousand and fifty dollar profit minus what it costs to stable feed entrance fee for that race that we ran. Um, but yeah, it came to us. It was one out of one in that grade two, and we have sold it on. I did not remember to uh, to geld it. So that's a bit of a problem. So yeah, we're now at the end of December. I also did some save and crash to get Black Cuckoo out into the transfer list because I think that's our basically our Hall of Fame. All the good horses we've had in Starters Order 7. Like that is the best of the best. So Black Cuckoo, I believe, should be in that mix. Um, but we don't want to take them out of this game. But we want to have this version in there, so I thought we'd do that as a two-year-old. It'd get imported as a three-year-old. That's not a bad thing to have happen. So, I'm going to get us round to the start of the new season. We're going to list all the horses, and we are going to, um, yeah, get into the sales, rename all the other horses, and I'll bring you back once more when we're actually there this time, providing no more crashes. So, I'll be seeing you soon. Actually, I'll be seeing you right now because the first one I checked, Sam is at Lime and Shop Array. Um, looks like a good enough horse to me. So. Keying. Okay, we're going we're gonna to keying. 
sums up Loon's Lime's other one is decent. Again, if we're ignoring finish application slightly, then I think we we'll keep in and party triumph. Zero finish application, but a ton. I think this was the experimental one. Experimentalist. There we go. And I like the fact that so far we're three from three. At worst, we're three out of seven. Low extra speed. Again, I'm going to test. I think we're going to test. So this is experiments as well. It's not great, but it's really not bad, especially without potential. I mean, we're just getting like really good. Keeps it please. And then Jimmy Calvin. There's so much not to like, but then there's also stuff to like, so. It's just going to be a keep. Um, yeah, I'll probably run through these at the start of the next season, all the keeps, all the experiments, and figure out what we want to do. If we actually want to keep them or not. But it looks like Sonny Lothian Reigns and All Back No Bike that did not come up with a good pairing. Uh, and I think, if I'm right, they failed to come up with a good pairing both times. Which means Lothian Reigns. Uh -uh. Stars de Gratis. That was the one I was interested in. Yeah, it doesn't look like a great breeder, really. Okay, now we can buy one, because uh, we sold the other one. We can actually buy... We can actually buy one. Two and a half. Two point three is usually our breaking point. Just come under it. And there we go then. Really, really solid. Let's go take a look at that final one we picked up. Mark Bay Tattle. From Nakshaban. And Cozina yourself. Great start. Very good acceleration. Low speed. Bang average. Bang average. Um, probably going to sell that. Probably going to sell that. Okay, so once again, bear with me as we uh, go through everything until we are ready to uh, to go. Look at that speed. Great speed. Great acceleration. Didn't gain anything. Did we not gain anything at all? Maybe... Extra, no. Yeah, we, we seem to be where we were. That's decent. Okay. Okay, we're back. We are back. So, we sold them. We got 58, 59 million in the bank. Uh, so, we now got the Timid Prince. Named due to having no confidence. Also being out of Princeville and the Tearaway Lady. Um, not really sure what we were going to do with that kind of thing there. But yeah, so his mother's been ripped away. Father was a prince. That makes him a prince. Um, and lack of confidence makes him timid. So a timid prince. Lily flower. Just because the F's here. Franz flutter like butterflies going into flowers. Blah, blah, blah. I don't really know. Medicinal compound, lily of pink. So lily flower. Let's go. Really like that horse. Um, a lot. <laughs> a lot. Feel gonna jock and on the Nile, so athletic denial. Get it. Get it. Um 
and then Tom Bewild for Miss Kitty and Nance Season. Um, so Tom, it, uh, yeah, because so Thomas Benjamin Wilder Square. Don't know who that is. Look him up. Maybe some um, swear words in there. So be careful, but very decent. I was listening to the song. Um, that went viral a while ago by him. And so, yes, a horse. That's how my brain works. So, yeah. <laughs> Not really named after what the horse is. And then Irish Treaty. Looks pretty decent. Got Shillelagh and a protocol. So, Irish Treaty. Black Cuckoo. Why was we named uh, that way? Why was the name Black Cuckoo? Anybody? No? Yeah. Um, not really sure why. But it's got something to do with the Red Swan that I went to Black Cuckoo. And I'm not sure why I went Red Swan. It's had a great... A great... Um, status Order 6, I think, horse. Called Red Lightning. Um, which was from Red Beard, which was from um pirate pants or something i believe so it, it kind of just went down and down and down um through the breeding program and is a very very good horse and then of course we've got miss swan etc who were one of my best ever horses so red swan fits in really nicely and because of that we went and did our thing elsewhere with black um <laughs> Black Cuckoo, I guess. Okay, let's check them. Shop Beret. Four-year-old Semti. You know, decent. Decent. Produced a coat that is decent. You get another shot then. Offspring is keep it please. That means we are keeping... You in? Yeah, Clowance is decent enough. Miss Kitty looks okay. We got Tom B. Wild, and now we got Keep Miss Kitty is um, gonna stick around. Symphony Time. Yeah, looks okay. That's an experimental one. Yeah, I think we're we're done with ex we're done with you. I'm. Oh. Raid. Oh, Park no Bike looks really good, but pulls out a failure. Uh, Six-year-old, worth keeping around. Litas Valentine, again, looks okay. It's another experiment, though, so. And, of course, then we've got Red Swan, who produced two really poor ones. So, yeah, perhaps my methods don't add up. Who knows? Who knows indeed? Um, Selkirk, I think, did okay. Selkirk did okay. It gave us experiments with Symphony Time, who's now gone. Shop Rain Selkirk? Why not? Clowance. Went with Chris Johnson. Okay. So maybe seeking the best. Miss Kitty, have you gone with Chris Johnson? That was Nan Sazen and Stars Grandis. No, you haven't. So. Chris Johnson. Or back, no bite. Ortiz. That was Lodian Reigns. Okay. Um, um, not really 100% sure here. Perfectus Elliot, I guess, maybe. Plaything Springs.
It's not the best, is it? Not the best. Um, Quest Condor. I think will work. And then Red Swan. With Sam is that lame. Uh, I believe the first time we didn't really get a good enough horse to keep. Second time we got two. So I don't know. But I want to try with our best stats horse, which is Red Swan in the barn. And just bring more of that into our breeding makeup, perhaps. So there we go. We got Black Cuckoo, who's looking pretty decent. So let's see if we can find a nice little uh, race to start with. We're going to have to go here. And yeah, grade three. So that's going to be a no. Then a bunch of maidens. So early maidens. Early Maidens at six with a short field. That's kind of what I'm looking for. Eight would be maximum for me. Let's put you in there. Let's put you in that one there for six. Um, you in there on the seventh. You in there on the eighth. And then on the ninth. Okay, they're not too crazy. They're not too crazy. Okay. Uh, first sale of Nort is going to be Breeders, 10th of February. Nort Legends are running yet. We only really care about the Lamy. Okay. Lily Flower, raring, raring to go. Third in a maiden. Settle mid, ran on, better for run. So ran green. That's what I'm hearing there. Ran green. Once a five. Okay. Small field, even smaller field. Lovely. Athletic Denial. Yeah, okay. I mean, it was muddy. Certainly ran green, slightly too far, etc., etc. Oh. Throw you in on the 20th. Tom B. Wild. Second in a maiden. Tardy start. Stayed on. Almost got up. Written as closer. Doesn't really say anything. Makes it really difficult to tell what we're going to be doing. So, somewhere on there, 24th. We lock you in. Timid Prince. I mean, that's a pretty bad one there. Faded, better for run, ran green. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll try again at six. Let's book you in. And there we go. That's what we're used to. That's what we're used to not winning a maiden at all. Oh, not winning the maiden. Still looks okay. It doesn't look like a bad horse or anything. So too fast, so we got another five. Okay. Another five, late headway, didn't run well. Didn't seem to run green. Didn't seem to have a problem. I don't really know what the... Uh, what the big issue there would be. Skip on through then. End of the month. More maidens. So two today. 
one then one then one then okay so six and four timid prince our worst horse by far weakened was leading and then ended up five lengths back Not certain the trip suited. We didn't get that feedback on the first one. We didn't get that on the first one. Okay. Ah, oh, Lily Flower. Dwelt run and snatch it. So not a good run and still almost won. Again, though, definitely. A five furlong horse. Give you another chance. Then Athletic Denial, we dip down to five. That looks to be the right trip. Big win. Nice. Athletic Denial, nice. Irish Treaty seems to be okay. Three lengths, that's a big win. Nice. Sorry, that was over five as well. Yeah, we're coming down to fives and we're working out. Then this one at six. Yeah, okay. So we've got two fives and a six. We've got some big, big, big wins there in those three. And we've got a, um, a problem with the distance here on um, Timid Prince, I guess. But Lily Floor should have won, didn't win. So we'll run that again. Um, but again, I don't think there's going to be anything like really worth running with these horses for a while. I just don't believe so. Although there is a grade two. Who is my six? It was Tom. Those two are both fives, yes? Okay. So close. They're so close to the day. Okay. Let's let's just see on the day of what do we look like? Yeah, we're jaded. It's kind of what I thought, but again, we just, you know. We want to try and at least give ourselves a little chance. You know, we can't do too much sometimes, but... We'd like to at least try. And there ain't going to be any short order grade ones for a long time there. Okay, so we got three races booked. We're going to have to wait on some decent tests at five furlong for Treaty and Denial. But Prince and Flora run again, trying to win their maiden at the third time of asking. Tomba Wild got a chance to win a grade three at least at six. Black Cuckoo, we are waiting on. But she has been added to the transfer list. We got a ton of money. We have got six horses already in full. We'll see how that works out. Sam is at Lime has come up decent for us. So we'll see how that works out. Um, and yeah, we've got these as well. We've got two experiments. We've got four keeps for next season. Plus we got one already to sell. I don't know. As I say, I think that's going to be very interesting to uh, see how everything works out. But we've got a pretty decent lineup, I think, going in uh, for this season. As we just enter the second month of the season, 1st of February. That's where we're going to leave it. Until next time, thank you very much for watching. I hope you're enjoying. Let me know in the comment section if you are, if you aren't, what you want to see more of, less of, etc. You're in charge just as much as me. So let me know what you want to see. And until then, guys, y'all take care. I'll see you back here soon for more racing at Rascal's Ranch. You're on Stars Order 7. It's going to be interesting. I hope it's a lot of fun along the way.